Hello, hello, and welcome back to Thomas Talks. I'm Thomas, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my Louis Vuitton wearable wallet. I've had this now for about three months, uh, or two months actually, two months. Uh, this is January, and I got it in November, late November, early December, I can't remember exactly when I was in Cannes, and I kind of want to just show you how it is. It's had its first outing today. Uh, I've worn it on my day off just to go kind of out to the shops, run errands, and I went for the all black uh, on black when I was debating between this one and the monogram canvas version. Uh, but I just thought, why not just go for the extra kind of all black, because it's a little bit more subtle as well. I quite like the look of it. It's just kind of like a square, blade, <laughs> a square black bag even. I'm actually surprised at how much things you can get in it. So, um, without further ado, we'll get on and crack on with opening it up. Uh, I do quite like some of the details of it. It does have the matte black hardware and the zip as well is in that matte black as well. People online saying it kind of chips. Uh, fingers crossed it doesn't happen to me. Um, but we'll see how we get on with ownership and using this bag. So it zips all the way across. And once you open it, it's kind of got a wee elasticated bit here and at the other side as well. So it gives you a little bit more flexibility. I will admit I haven't jam-packed this full of stuff uh, and today for anybody who's maybe wondering I do have my loop it blazer on and the instinct rings as well amongst other jewellery. <laughs> uh, so we'll open up, there's the bag there and we can see we have the little clay which actually holds the car key fob in it and I've got the Louis Vuitton wallet in here um, as well which is literally bursting full of cards and other cards. <laughs> uh, inside we do have a little bit of room for individual cards to go. So say for example I don't want to take my wallet out, I could put the cards, like your credit card, debit card, I've got the movie your waitress, points card, something like that in there. And then there's another wee compartment just behind that there which I actually haven't found a use for yet but I'm sure something could be used. There's also a zip component on the other side, so if I show you guys there, we've got a little zip in here which you can pull up. It's so easy to do with one hand, but there we go. And again, it's just lined with kind of, a, I wouldn't say like polyester kind of material, it doesn't feel particularly luxurious in there, but yeah, it's kind of like a nylon-y, polyester -y material, probably wearable, wipeable, all that good stuff. And again, just behind that zip compartment, there's another wee compartment in there which you could put other bits. So, all in all, decent size. Uh, I can show you there's the wallet kind of there. And because of the thickness as well, it's actually quite good because you can get two pieces side by side. Uh, I'm using my phone to record, otherwise I would show you <laughs> I could fit the phone in there as well. But really, that's all I need is car keys, a wallet and my phone and it carries it all perfectly. And there's also gonna be a little bit of room in there for other documents you might wanna carry, maybe if you're on holiday, your passport, or other bits of paperwork. But a good kind of wearable piece, uh, quite a nice size. I like the little detailing around the edges, kind of trunk-esque. Uh, maybe one day I'll go and go full plunge into one of the hard-sided pieces. Actually, funny story, before I bought this, I was interested in getting or looking at the hard-sided version of this which is slightly a different shape it's not called a wearable wallet but yeah um i did try it on i just felt the kind of hard plywood material <laughs> against your body just made it look dead boxy this is a lot bit softer is the main reason i kind of went for it but i saved that for another video uh but yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick update on the louis vuitton wearable wallet as always stay safe thanks very much for watching if you like this video please give me a thumbs up subscribe to thomas talks below i'm almost at a thousand subscribers so really appreciate it if you could uh, check me out on tiktok twitter facebook all that good stuff all below luck scott is my instagram i'll also leave that down below and thank you very much for watching if you have any questions on the wearable wallet please comment below and i'll get back to you ciao